Asia Cup, India and Sri Lanka in the final. We have the R. Premadasa International Stadium. Heads. Heads is the call. Heads. Heads it is. Abhishek, you won the toss. What are you going to do? Uh, we're going for bat first. Big event. Huge tournaments. Normally very exciting for the younger players. And we've seen many a player come through the youths, the under-19s. Shaw to take the first ball. And Rana partnering him. And he got a big 100 in the semi-final. Anyway, here is the first ball of the Asia Cup final, Youth Asia Cup final. And off the mark. Just working it nicely between the gap at mid picket and square leg. A couple of runs. India off the mark of the very first delivery. Straight past the bowler. What timing in that shot. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. In the gap between the bowler and mid-off. That's short and wide and cut handsomely towards the cover boundary. And there's the shot that comes in. There's a false shot up in there. Mid-on settling down under it, taking a comfortable catch. That's a breakthrough that Sri Lanka were looking for. India losing their first wicket at 67. The man in form, Shaw, departing for 39. Prithvi Shaw is gone for 39. Shubnam Gill comes out to bat. Oh, that's a, a glorious straight drive. That's his 50. What a fine innings it has been. Just continues to pile on the runs and uh, seem to be uh, living up to that great expectations the Indian team has of uh, Himanshu. Very well played indeed. And there's the boundary that India were looking for. Himanshu Rana breaking the shackles. There is Boldem. Just take a look wide of the crease. The ball was drifting in. He was playing the angle. It was the turn of the pitch that defeated him. Himanshu Rana, 71 of 79. India now, 155 for two. Brings out Abhishek Sharma to the pitch. Second Indian batsman to get a 50 today. Just off 67 balls. Here we go. Goes over extra cover and goes all the way. Fantastic hit. Beautiful six. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Enjoy the extra pace. And the 200 is up. This is high. Might be taken at long off. It is taken, so Abhishek Sharma goes, important wicket for Sri Lanka. He was looking good, he was looking uh, to try and take on the Sri Lankan bowling. And a wicket at a critical time of the Indian innings. Third wicket falls at 203 for Salman Khan, he's the new batsman. As I speak, a poor delivery. Goes for the big one, long on, has taken it. It's a really good catch. It was the pressure created by a series of uh, non-boundary balls. They were just getting the singles. So looking for the big shot down the ground. In the end, it's a fabulous catch and wicket number three. Bandara taking a good catch to complete uh, that uh, catch and take the wicket of uh, Shubham Gill for 70. This is the time for Sri Lanka to get back into the game. Exactly. They've got two new batsmen at the crease at the business end of the inning. The other left arm spinner. This could be safe and over as well. Got a long way across towards the off stump there. Length again, driven straight to the field at short extra cover. Salman Khan departs, the set batman losing his wicket once again. 26 
Salman Khan runs it as his second wicket. The new batsman for India, Het Patel. Starts off with a full toss and a direct hit which could be close. A loud appeal from the Sri Lankans and almost a run out at the other end. If the fielder had collected the ball cleanly, it was certainly a run out at the other end. We'll still have to go back to the third umpire to check the first run out appeal. Z save. Normally you'll find the direct hit. Yes, he's gone. He's suddenly gone. So red is got to go. Brilliant bit of work by Sri Lanka. I'm sure the Indian batters, low order batters, would not have much batting to do on this tour. Oh, was that an edge? And did it carry? And there's a third. A third wicket for Ransika. A slight off cutter running his fingers across the seam. Priyam, the man dismissed Priyam Gar, gone for five. It's all happening too quickly for India with the wickets falling. India have had a very successful tournament so far. Two more deliveries left, and this one is hit high in there. Two fielders coming under it. I call for it, and he's put that down. That's number six. That's a full toss. That's it. High and over the long leg boundary. Poor delivery to start off the over. Fine leg should take this. Yes, comfortably. This time, the slower delivery on the shorter side gets away with that. Might have been targeting for a six, but finding the fielder this time round. Nakar Kodi making 23 in quick time with a good strike rate has to go. 23 for him. It's 272 for Reed. Now The batsmen have crossed while the ball was in there. Means Shiva is on strike to fail the, face the last ball of the Indian innings. Slow ball once again, drilled to long off. They're going to come back for two. Here comes the throw, and they just have to settle for the one. 273 India finish up with at the end of their 50th over. The Indian camp look happy with that. They know they've got runs on the board. They seem confident towards the uh, end of the innings, even though they tailed away a little bit. They seem confident that they have enough runs on the board. Sri Lanka will have to bat really well to get this uh, target of 274. R. Kelly on strike for Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka will have to bat well to chase down 274. The first ball worked off his pads by Rivan Kelly in much the same way that the Indian innings got underway. Sri Lanka getting off with a couple of runs. Oh, lucky streaky shot there, he's going to get four for it. And smacked hard. Runs away to the boundary very quickly. This has been taken, it's a soft dismissal. Was the shot delivery. Chaturanga might have found the body too, ball too close to the body. Then have the space to free his arms and he finds the fielder. India have picked up the dangerous man, Chaturanga. He'll be disappointed. Astita Boyagoda comes out to bat. I'll sail over the keeper. Suddenly got some bat or glove onto that. Oh, this is a big one. This is huge. It's gone quite a distance. My goodness me. That's a great shot. Over the top. That's an excellent shot. Hitting it on the up. And Kelly goes over the top. Has it gone all the way? And there it is. A hike up in the air. Long on settling down under it. And he drops it. What a let off. For Revan Kelly that is. In the air and take it, it's a soft dismissal. Nicely tossed up by the skipper. Away from the body, forcing the batsman. Boyagoda, who's looking really good. The strike rate of 100. 
37 for Boyagoda. It's 105 for two. Coming to Mendes, one of the seniors in the Sri Lankan team. There goes the reverse sweep. That's a boundary for the captain. Nicely driven, half stopped. For the 52, Kelly, what a fine innings that has been. Lanka on the other hand. Oh, that's a very fine shot again. There goes for the big one, miscued it. Deep mid wicket, will he take it? Yes, he has. Opened the door for India, the breakthrough that they were looking for. The captain himself bringing himself back on. Kelly trying to hoist that high into the night sky at Premadasa. Down for 62, it's 158 for three. Krishan, Krishan Sanjula. Unlucky again. Ah, there's the edge, just falling short of the slip fielder. Smash back and a brilliant catch. Is this the moment? Moment of inspiration. Brilliant cotton ball. Outstanding. This is what India needs. So he's out for 14. It's 196 for four. Spandara comes in. Lots of pressure on. Slip in place. Gets off the mark. Poor delivery, but what a catch this was. 197 for four. And he's now on 50. A very fine innings by Kamidu Mendes. It's been a captain's knock. Appreciated by his teammates in the dugout. Oh, that's a poor miss. There's a bit of a confusion, a direct throw. Maybe there'll be a referral. There was a chance at the strikers then. Yeah, he's nowhere close. Shiva had the presence of mind to hit the stumps at the non-strikers end. So that has to be out. That's definitely out, no doubt about it. A run out and pressure on Sri Lanka is out for two. It's 201 for five. Jehan Daniel, exciting uh, young prospect. It was always clear that India needed wickets. And a couple of runs here, good running. Very good running indeed. Some urgency on the part of the Sri Lankans. They need those twos. Stegen! Would you believe it? Actually, it was not a bad shot. But it's a brilliant piece of fielding. Had to time his jump to perfection. Struck really hard. It's a fabulous catch taken. And the captain, Abhishek Sharma, strikes. That's a much needed hour for India. Good shot delivery, but the result is run away to the boundary. Oh, that's chipped up in there. It's going to be a simple catch to the extra cover fielder. And nicely tossed up. Good position of the seam. There's nowhere near the pitch of the ball, looking to close the face of the bat. Was in the air for a long time. But Shiva Singh might have been under pressure, but he held his nerve and he held the catch as well. Oh, he's tripped it up in the gear again. Oh, what a disappointing wicket that is. Jehan Daniel, what was he trying there? Soft dismissal again. He's gone for 50 in Jahan Daniel. And another one gone. It's a good stumping. It was the top spinner. Stays down, comes up with the bounce. An easy stumping. Ransika has gone for just two balls for a duck. Javikrama bowled uh, really well. Overstepping. A run out possibility is there with the no ball. They're starting to celebrate. Up goes the finger. He's given it out straight away. Would you believe it? It all ends with the run out of a no ball. 
And Abhishek Sharma is the man who's showing his emotions now. He's been really quiet right through this match. And he's bowled brilliantly. 4 for 37 for the Indian captain. And finally, it's confirmation. India winning the Youth Asia Cup for the under-19 boys. They got 273.